Howdy, 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 everybody. How are you doing, y'all? My name is Simply Valka, and today, darlings, I'm going to be getting into a daily tarot message, and this is going to be a message that needs to reach specific people, y'all. So hopefully this message brings some resonance to somebody out there. If you find this, this reading helpful, let me know in the comments below how you find it helpful, because that is how I keep up with you guys, is through the comments down below if you enjoy this tarot reading today, or you just enjoy my vibe. I would really appreciate it, y'all, if you were to give this video a like and subscribe, because it does help me out a lot. I always appreciate it when you do that extra step. Keep in mind, I am just a man reading some tarot cards to you. You know your situation better than ever possibly could. Take the cards that resonate to leave what doesn't. Uh, these readings are just here to give you some food for thought for the day, a perspective to consider never making choices in your life. It doesn't matter what you identify as either, whether it's he, she, they, them, anything inside or outside of that spectrum, darling. If this reading's going to resonate with you, darling, it's going to resonate. I do all the weekly general tarot zodiac signs, so be sure to check out your weekly general zodiac. Uh, reading. So let's just jump into this uh, tarot reading for, to, for today. Let's see the tarot message, daily tarot message for those that need to hear this. And right now we have the Ten of Earth, the Ten of Pentacles that step forward for y'all. So this card says, if you are not able to read it, it says a very happy family life financial security and finding the magic and little things in life right so very fabulous card earth energy is referring to pentacles for those that are curious so this is technically the ten of pentacles if i didn't already say so a very uh financially abundant card and it's not just with finances you know that's there's a reason why this card talks about uh family security a very happy family life and that is because it's just overall very stable energy that you guys are coming into right now um i do i keep on being shown a ship that's in like some like in a storm out in the sea right now so I, I'm willing to bet at this current point in time uh, you probably feel like a ship that's out and stuck in a storm currently and just trying to find a, trying to find that lighthouse to give like the sense of direction giving you hope that you're going to be making out of this and I feel like this ten of pentacles comes in as this very strong affirming message for y'all that you guys are on the path towards that ten of pentacles you guys are on the path towards having that very happy family life and remember it doesn't just mean family by blood darling i feel like i need to clarify that and let it be known that it's like it's the family that you choose to have right um you know it just is this sense of just overall stability coming in for you and you know i'm going to be focusing more so now on the financial portion of this because that is what is calling to me the most at this current point in time when it comes to this card we have the emperor card stepping forward for this right off the bat so this is the time to do it now is the time um, that's kind of the message that I'm getting with this is now is the time to be working on your projects It's not tomorrow. It's not next week. It's not that the start of the next month darling It's now now is the time if you're wanting to get to your abundance darling What is it that you've been putting off at this current point in time that you're just like, oh, I'll just wait until November 1st I'll just wait until it's next Monday the start of a new week. No, you need to do this now I don't care if it's about you deciding that you need to lose 10 pounds darling before you start that project, right? Do it now now because the things that you do now are really going to set you up for the success that is clearly coming towards you but the success only comes to you if you are able to or willing to put in the work to have it come forward does that make sense so the emperor card is really coming in as this message of where it's like leading with the vision y'all leading with the vision and just focusing in on it and doing then doing the necessary things to set up for your future um i just i keep on hearing now is the time now is the time now is the time this is just a very successful time um, that you guys are going to be going into and it's like you're going to be thanking yourself later down the road and not much later let's be clear about that I don't feel like it's gonna be much later y'all um, you're gonna be thanking yourself later down the road that you took the steps today to really go forward towards your dreams your aspirations whatever it is for you some people it's gonna be that you know that romantic uh, relationship other platonic you know for others it's gonna be financial I do again I want to point out that I feel like this is for primarily a message for those that are speaking in terms of like a financial goal wanting to reach a certain standard when it comes to their career it doesn't have to be financially attached to it but eight of pentacles stepping forward as well this is the card of elevation this is the card of going back to school by definition but as we all know in the 21st century y'all that the school is not everything so don't take this as a message where it's like you need to go to college if you're feeling drawn to go to college then go to college darling but this is just a time of where you guys are in this process of elevating really hone in and go deeper into the projects that you're wanting to do um, i'm being shown a microphone right now so i don't know if you guys are interested in public speaking i'm going to just use the analogy 
of YouTube like I always do when it comes to career, just because obviously that's something we're all familiar with. Um, if you're wanting to do a YouTube channel, if you're wanting to have like a voice of your own on a platform, now is the time to be taking those steps to doing it. I don't care what your reservations are. I don't care what your excuses are. I was talking about in my live stream where I was just like, um, my friend Shane on the live stream was talking about how... Um, he wants to do a YouTube channel, but his perfectionism will get out of the get it in the way. And it's like, I don't care. Like the perfectionism, you're always going to have that. You always are going to think of things that you want to improve on. Um, if you don't, then that's kind of a sign that you're becoming stale, really, more than anything. Like you should be striving for the sense of wanting to do more. You should be really, you know, that's never going to dissipate. But, you know, the thing that you the only way that you can get from point A to point B is actual action, y'all. So that's just the thing I really want to say with this six of pentacles coming in here as well it's just it's just giving me very much so this vibe you're getting all pentacle energy is what i also want to point out right now all pentacle energy which pentacles is famously known for in tarot for finances because pentacles looks like coins darling right coins 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 so those quintadas um I just feel as if, you know, this is like a, you know, obviously it's going to like the actions that we do, like, right, if you want to like lose weight, you want to start a business or whatever, the steps that you do now, it's obviously always going to pay off in the future. But I'm getting this sense now of where it's just like the things that you do now, especially when it comes to building your career, let's just say like a YouTube channel, if you start doing it now, I actually feel as if like the payoff for, um, doing that would actually come in quicker if not even better than what you would do have if you were to wait down the road that's kind of what this vibe is giving me because the six of pentacles comes in as this message where it's just like yeah it's just it's like you know the scales are off balance for you right now where it's like you have this giant pot of gold waiting to be lifted into your grasp but you have to fill the other side with effort if that makes sense hopefully my analogies are not um confusing people i always like to speak better in analogies because i feel like that gets the message across better but um yeah i just feel as if like you know if you were to start this youtube channel now as an example you would have a lot more success and a lot more traction quicker compared to if you were to wait a month or wait a year to open up that YouTube channel. I don't know why, but it just feels as if like for the people that I'm connecting to that are claiming this current uh, daily reading, uh, the efforts that you put in now are just, it's like the multiplication, the multiplier has just turned on for you, right? If you're going to view energy as a multiplier, where it's just like, like you get like double the reward for like half the effort, if that makes sense. Three of Pentacles, continuing on with this Pentacle energy, y'all, really continuing on with this. This is just a time of where you guys need to be doing collaborations. This is a time for you guys to be really working together with other individuals individuals and just yeah building up to something bigger you know the collab this is the card of really where it's like the the sky's the limit essentially the sky's the absolute limit for you guys and it's just about really just going out and doing it y'all like you guys are just consistently getting more and more pentacle energy here and i like i don't know <laughs> i don't know if i even need to continue on with this reading admittedly just because of just like how straightforward this message is i just feel as if like success is on the horizon for you guys you just have to take action to this right now like uh, <laughs> what is that one meme who is it who is that one guy that's like just do it and is just like screaming and flexing who is that guy someone tell me oh it's shia buff shia La shia LaBeouf, shia buff something shia honey to a swords yeah this is the point in time you have to cross you have to make a choice you have to you can't just continue keeping yourself guarded keeping uh pretending as if like what it is that you like that you can continue wait putting your plans putting your goals off until tomorrow until the next week because you're going going to be consistently in that cycle you need to be doing something you need to be doing the things now darling i don't care what it is i don't care what excuses that you have that you think sounds fabulous enough for this you need to be doing it now get out of your head and just do it you have nothing to lose but absolutely Absolutely everything to gain and you guys are absolutely based off of these cards are going to be gaining a lot with this so yeah guys i don't know how else to really like stress this where it's just like all these cards are just talking about doing things now we have your final three cards coming out right off the bat for you guys so i'm going to take it one by one but i'm going to show each one you guys have the three of water or the three of cups coming in for you this card says a celebration a wedding graduation or birth announcement the need to have more fun you know so definitely this is <laughs> like i can't help but just feel as if like you guys would have so much to celebrate for really quickly 
if you were to go after your goals. Now, this is crazy, y'all. Two of fire coming in here or the two of wands. This card says, y'all, you've come into your own new partnerships or contracts. What was I talking about with that? Three of pentacles, y'all. Continue moving forward, you know? So it's like you're thinking, like, the, you guys really want to be making those long-term plans. You guys really need to... Um, start speaking your truth start speaking what it is that you want to be doing because i feel as if you starting to putting in the effort now you're going to be attracting the people that are able to help build up your goals help build up your dreams or even at the very least just have people really receive the uh messages the whatever it is the work that you put out there out like i just this is just such you guys are just getting nothing but extremely positive cards y'all and then we have the queen of pentacles the queen of earth that stepped forward as well Make time for those around you. Take a sensible approach and deal with challenges in a kind and understanding manner. So with the Queen of Pentacles, this is a card of where... Again, the Queen of Pentacles is very craft. I mean, this is the Queen of Earth, rather, but, you know, y'all get my point at this point. <laughs> the Queen of Pentacles is all, like, really the master of the coin. She is able to get to what she needs to do to be taken care of, to, to do what sustains her. Queen of Pentacles in this card as well brings forth the message of those around you. I feel as if heavily for many of you guys, you actually have people around you that could help you, that could really help build up your dreams, help build up whatever it is that you're wanting to do. You just have to make it known. You have to start putting in the effort, right? You have like the people are around you that can help you, or even if you don't know that they're around you currently, you putting out your work is, is going to attract these people that are already around you. They're just waiting for that sign. They're waiting for, as I was saying at the beginning, right? Uh, you being in that stormy see on that boat you know they're waiting for their own like lighthouse signal they're waiting for the signal to turn on the lighthouse perhaps right and be like hey come over here right but it's up to you to play ball essentially it's up to you to really take action on this so it's just like ask yourself the question of like what's been holding you back and are these excuses really more valuable to you than the very fabulous abundant future that is being laid out in front of you with these tarot cards right you know ask yourself the question if you want to be a millionaire if you're not already um ask yourself the question is like are those excuses million dollar excuses you know i could have you know this youtube channel couldn't would have the possibility of not existing if i chose to wait until my perfectionism was satiated right you know but it's because i just chose to do it you lo i lost nothing but I gained everything. I gained all of you guys. And so I want you guys to think about it. It's just like you are on the path towards the Ten of Pentacles. You are on the path towards the Ten of Earth, which is all that abundance, all that stability in your life. You guys just have to really just leave your shell. I'm being shown the Hermit card. Maybe some of you guys have been in a little bit of a depressive bout recently. And I'm not trying to play that down at all, darling. I am the last person to play that down. I have go through my depression streaks all the time, darling. But it's just like you have to pick yourself up and you have to find something to remain hopeful for and you know i just see i see such a successful future for those that are regulars to my channel y'all know i do not sugarcoat things you can look up the meanings of these cards yourself and understand like how all these cards just go together in such a beautiful abundant way you know i'm not about sugarcoating darling if i didn't see success coming in darling i would be like okay girl like maybe i might have you considered this route instead <laughs> right let's work on you know it'd be talking about i would be the message would be very different but you guys have this is very much so like promise success but it's just the, you know the ball is in your court and so it's just like what are, when are you guys going to start taking action i just see so much success for you guys in the near future if you were to take action but that's really the key point i suppose right is you know just needing to take action so let's close this reading off y'all with an animal oracle card you guys have the pig spirit number 47 which would be what 11 Ooh, girl 11 come on now lucky 11 making a wish you know this is the time you know getting into i haven't even looked at the card itself besides the pig spirit uh number 11 that is an angel number for like you know you think about 11 11 you're making a wish like this is really just such a fabulous reading y'all i don't know how it's to really like i wish <laughs> like y'all could really feel just like how impactful this energy is like and i know this is probably gonna just get lost in a sea of other tarot readings which is just talking about just a bunch of like abundance da, 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 da. but truly like these cards are just very much so to the point and just flowing so beautifully y'all uh this card says using your mind wisely at this point so you guys are being called out right now with your mindset you know you guys have the mindset you have the intelligence 
diligence, y'all, to really be extremely successful. Not to say that you're not already successful, but you could take it up 20 notches, darling. You know, you're not living up to your potential, but, you know, there's something with your mind, darling, something with your mindset, something, you know, maybe uh, you're not nearly as disciplined as you nearly, as you once used to be, right? Look at your mind. Look at, again, look at the excuses that you're telling yourself and ask yourself, are these million dollar excuses? Because quite literally, like, I see so much potential success in this. Like, I wouldn't be surprised. Like, like, I truly wouldn't be surprised if this is like a millionaire energy, but it's just like, you only can get to that millionaire energy if you are willing to put in the work. You just get the benefit of seeing in these cards that like your work actually would pay off to get to that point, you know? Truly, like many people are just like, will be reserved and be like, oh, I don't know if I'll be successful at it. I don't know if anyone would care watching, da 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 da. Girl, no. Like, you see in these cards, darling, that they're just quite literally telling you, like, people are here to uplift you. People are going to be receptive of you and you're going to be very abundant. You just have to do it. So, I don't know, y'all. I'm going to get off this soapbox and hopefully this reading inspired you guys. Hopefully this caught you at the right time. Let me know if you claimed this reading in the comments below. I hope you found this reading helpful in some type of way. We remember to do be sure to check out your sun moon and rising um readings i do your re i do weekly general readings for all the zodiac signs every monday tuesday wednesday and thursday um if you want to book a private to personal reading with me my website's always linked down below simply falco Dot com. I have a coupon for 20% off going on right now for a little bit longer for my private readings if you guys want to connect with me. And also be sure to follow my social medias, TikTok and Instagram, being Simply Velka Darling. And hopefully I can connect with y'all sometime in the near future. I love y'all so much. Bye.